Ooh, what's up, guys? So I'm going to be showing you how to fix your charger not working. So this is my Nintendo Switch charger. For some reason, it's not charging my Switch. I'm right now using a Google Pixel phone charger because it's the same thing as the Nintendo Switch charger. So, step number one. So you want to see, you want to look at the charger for any dots around it. You guys can see there's a lot of dot around this charger, so what you're going to do is you're just going to go grab a piece of toilet paper, or like like maybe something that will like clean it, and just rub, and then just clean the thing. So I'll be right back after cleaning it. So I'm trying to clean it, obviously. It's, it's clearly cleaning. I'm obviously cleaning it. So I'll be right back once there's like no dot on it. Now let's see if it'll charge the switch. So I'm gonna plug it in and I'll show you guys if it's charging. You guys can see nothing is happening. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna try both sides of the charger. Either that side or the other side is charging the actual switch. So what it could be is it could be the wall outlet you're using and you gotta figure that out. How can we figure that out? What you can do is you can unplug the switch and see if anything happens when you unplug it. Let's see if it like turns on if you unplug it. So I unplugged it and nothing happened. So what it could possibly be is it could possibly be either the switch itself or the wall outlet you're using. So what you can do is you're just gonna unplug the which charge off from the wall and keep it unplugged for about a few minutes. So just keep it unplugged for about one minute and what I want you guys to do is I want you guys to use like maybe like a different charger around your house while you wait these few minutes. If your phone or uh, something is like at one person, I'd recommend you guys go use something else, or like go watch something else, or go use something else to watch this video. You do want to clean this too once you unplug it, so I'd recommend having it unplugged for about 10 to 20 minutes. That should work, so I'm like you're gonna have it unplugged for about 10 to 20 minutes and plug it back into the wall and see if that gives you power. Also, yes, you do want to clean it while you're waiting just in case. Okay, so it's been about 17 minutes for me. I do not want to wait 20. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna plug it back into my wall and then I'm gonna see if it gives me power when I plug in my switch. So let's do the test. And plug it into my switch and I'm gonna see if it turns on. And if it doesn't turn on, I'm gonna unplug it from the switch to see if it turns on. So here we go. All right, did not turn on when I plugged it in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna unplug it to see if it turns on. Did not turn on and I promise I plugged it in. And then I unplugged it, still didn't turn on. So now what we're going to do is we are just going to blow on the tip and the bottoms of the charger. So now let's do the test. I did not turn on. I'm going to unplug it. Did not turn on. Probably the new charge. So now what we can do with the charger, since this charger is probably broken, what we can do is we can plug it into the dock and plug the dock into the wall and see. Okay, so it's plugged into the dock now. Let's see, this charges it. That means it's charging. So if the dock walks, when it's plugged in, it's just the switch. Which is pretty good to know. If it's just the switch, that's good to know, at least. But you can just use the dock as your charger if this doesn't work and just move on with your life. But this is only for, like, this is only for, like, 
switches. If you have a phone and it didn't work, what you guys can do is you guys can purchase a cheap wireless charger and then just charge your phone through that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this video has helped you guys out. Goodbye.